you guys are doing well at home. We finally made it to break. Yes, and it has been glorious. Definitely. This VMA news segment is all about Christmas, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Mm -hmm. Hey, what do you call a snowman with a six-pack? I don't know. An abdominal snowman. <laughs> that's funny, but that's not what Christmas is all about. So let's go to Mateo so he can remind us what Christmas is really about. <laughs> Hi VMA, hope you're having a good break. Today in our spiritual thought, we're going to Luke 2 verses 8 to 11 and it says this. Now there were in the same country shepherds living out in the fields, keeping watch over the flock by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them and the glory of the Lord shone around them. And they were greatly afraid. Then the angel said to them, do not be afraid for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be to all people. For there is born to you this day in the city of David, a savior who is Christ the Lord. <clears throat> so. To, these verses uh, speak to me in a way that uh, lots of people think that you need to be in a certain situation in life, a certain status to be able to have communication with God or a spiritual life with God. But that's not the case here. God speaks to anybody, shepherds, uh, anybody in life. Uh, you don't need to be in a certain situation. God meets you where you are to carry out his extra, extraordinary plan. Thanks. That's our spiritual thought. That's a great reminder. God loves us with or without a title, and He looks at the heart. Yes, definitely, and God also brings people into our life to help free us or bring us closer to Him. Yeah, speaking of freeing, Jesus mm -hmm. has a very interesting fact for us today. But first, figure this out. Mm -hmm. What is a sheep's favorite Christmas song? What? Feliz Navidad. <laughs> 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 Feliz Navidad. <laughs> ah, Dr. Jesus is back. And... It's Christmas. What's also amazing about Christmas is the fact that prisoners of war will receive gifts from the card company and they would hide secret little maps inside of the cards and then they would then look at them and escape the prisons. John, wake up. Yes, sir. These came in the mail for you. Merry Christmas. Sergeant Brian Silva, report to the general's office right now. Wow, isn't that magnificent? And you know what else is magnificent? The gift of Jesus. And remember, when you see someone lonely, the best gift you can give them is love. And back to you guys, over and out. Wow, that is so amazing, but that was definitely very risky and dangerous. Yeah, thank God for companies and people who are willing to risk the safety of themselves to help others. Yeah. But on a lighter note, what does a gingerbread man use to make his bed? What? Cookie sheets! Mmm, <laughs> cookies! Mm. I love Christmas sweets. Yeah. Let's go see what some of the students have to share. To me, Christmas means spending time with family and celebrating the birth of Jesus. My favorite thing about Christmas is being around family, having good food, and celebrating the good joy of Christmas with other people too. I'm putting a smile on other people too and giving out gifts to people. My favorite thing about Christmas is spending time with my family and opening presents. My favorite thing about Christmas is when all my family members get together and we all eat food and we just enjoy the, enjoy the weather. Alright, so my favorite thing about Christmas, of course, is the food. Especially tamales, uh, lasagna. Ooh, delicious. Mm. Christmas is really uh, important for me because I can spend time with my family and and eat food. <laughs> yeah. Hey guys, so I feel like Christmas is a time where you get together with your family, you know, you talk together, get into groups, 
um, nice and cozy, warm with your chocolate, yeah. you know, in hand. And my, yeah. My favorite thing about Christmas is to spend time with my family and be with them. To me, Christmas means getting to spend time with friends. So typically during Christmas time we have a break and usually during break we can go see our friends and hang out with them and just the Christmas spirit and being with friends is really nice and it really means a lot to me. It's so interesting to hear what other people enjoy. I personally love eating cookies and I also love to bake them. Yeah, and for me, one of my favorite Christmas traditions is on Christmas Eve, we open the presents at 10 p.m. because in Chile, it's 12 a.m. So oh. technically, we're celebrating together. Well, that is so cool. Yeah. Now, what do sheep say to shepherds at Christmas time? I don't know, what? Season bleeding! <laughs> oh my, where do you get your jokes from? Well, up next, we have our sports segment, and they have something special for us. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> This is the laser shot. <laughs> this is the half court gym. Nice. This is called the pitcher. Hello, everybody. This is the wall bang shebang. This is the too close for comfort. Yeah, yeah. How do you even make one shot? No, we, we can tell, we can tell. Yeah, look, 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 look. We just need a better idea. Maybe some edit. Hey, 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 hey! It's the Travis Scott. <laughs> this is what I call... Called to soar. <laughs> this is called the Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay guys, this is called the Around the World. No. <laughs> that was the trick shot segment. Back to you. We have some real talent here, don't we? Thank you guys so much for the show. Yeah, can I get your autographs? That's a good idea. Well, our next joke is, why are Christmas trees so fond of the past? Why? Because the presents beneath them. Ah, uh, <laughs> good one. Yeah. I love seeing snow on pine trees. I wish it would snow more. I know. Well, the weather reporters may have more about that. Jordan, get in the shot. I'm not doing it. It's not that bad. It's come bad. On, come on, no, it's no, fine. It's I'm fine. Not going it's anywhere. Christmas themed. You're not going right? to do this. Please, please, just get in the shot. Why couldn't I wear the Santa costume? Well, because I like Santa. This costume's warm. I don't like bananas. Why do I have to wear the banana costume? Well, because I didn't have a budget. And that was the only other suit we had in storage, so... Hello, BMA. This is our weather segment for today. I'm Jordan, and this is my assistant, Kanan. Assistant. Not even like co -hanker? No. No? Assistant. Fine. All right. All right. In our first few weeks of December, we can expect temperatures in the low 40s and the high 30s, with temperatures getting all the way below freezing. Hey, Jordan, cheer up, all right? This is it's Christmas time, right? We should be in the Christmas spirit, you know, getting all happy and jolly and ho, 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 you know? So, just cheer up. I'm a banana! Okay, fair point. Towards the end of December, we will be getting snow and temperatures in the low 30s and the high 20s. So get your jackets, because it'll be cold. Ooh, right inside for Christmas, too. You know... We should, like, start getting working on, like, those presents and stuff. You're not getting any presents. Why not? I don't like you. <laughs> You're what? not getting anything from Why me. not? But, but, it's, it's Christmas time. It's, it's, it's all about giving. Right? No? The only thing I'm gonna give you okay. is a promotion! Yay! You're my co-host now. Hooray! Wow, that is some dedication. Yeah, congratulations on your promotion, Kanan. Yeah. And the final joke that we have for you guys is, what did Adam say to his wife on Christmas? What did he say? It's Christmas Eve. <laughs> well, well, now to our announcements. Here are some dates for you guys to look out for. So first, from December 8th to 17th, we have teacher in-services and meetings. And on December 25th, Merry Christmas! And January 1st, Happy New Year! <laughs> <laughs> 
January 10th, the dorms reopen at 3 p.m., so make sure you don't come early. And January 11th, second semester begins. Yep, hope to see you guys then. Have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And as always, stay proud to be BMA. BMA.